today. I hope that you are having an awesome day. Today is Wednesday the 30th, I believe. Yeah, you guys, so I'm out here in these Brooklyn streets. Yes, I am. I am on my way to um, do an eye exam and to pick out a new pair of glasses. Yay! Um, yeah, these have dropped so many times. Um, one of my Gucci symbols has come off and uh, I just need stronger glasses because I'm finding myself um, finding it hard to um, to read and you know and stuff with these on you know I mean it's like I can see and everything but it's just not giving that clarity so I know that it's time for me to um, go and get an exam done Yep. So, yes. And I'm going to also stop at the beauty supply store. I was supposed to do that yesterday or day before yesterday. But, um, you know, I was just so tired and I was did so much ripping and running, you know, till I just was like, you know what, I'm going to do this another day. So, yeah, today I took a mental health day, you know, definitely just needed a break from work <laughs> so I said you know what I'm just gonna go do a couple of things today you know nothing crazy but just a, just some things so yeah so how are you guys doing as we are embarking on this um as we are embarking on the holiday season you know I know that a lot of people are getting themselves together, planning their meals, doing a lot of uh, Christmas shopping or window shopping, you know. I started really early. I mean, if you guys don't know, I put up my decorations every year, November the 1st. So my stuff has been up for a while. Um, I did a lot of my Christmas shopping early as well. However, I still needed to, you know, do some little ins and some little outs, you know. But um, yeah, uh, I'm still trying to figure out what I'm going to cook for um, Christmas dinner because I mean do you guys are you like this like when I cook really big like for Thanksgiving I just get you know enjoy the meal but I just get like tired of the heavy foods or I feel like I've had enough you know and I'm, when it's Christmas time it's like uh I really don't want to have heavy food you know what I'm saying even though sometimes I end up cooking it again because of the request of my family but I really don't want to do that for Christmas this year you know what I'm saying like I don't want to cook the usual so what are you guys um cooking give me some ideas what are you guys cooking for um your Christmas dinner because I still haven't decided what um you know I'm doing yet yep um I'm definitely going to try and um, get to Manhattan and just show you guys a little bit of Manhattan and what it looks like um, during the Christmas holidays. But like I said, try. That's a big try because honestly, I do not like getting on that train. <laughs> I don't. I don't like getting on the train because these people is just acting up. Acting up, I tell you. home 
I did my eye exams and I picked out some fly glasses. I got two because they they um they were still having their Black Friday sale. So I got a pair of Adidas, which I will show um I will show you. It'll be somewhere in this. I don't know if it's gonna come before this clip or afterwards, but um a pair of Dita um glasses and a pair of Gucci. When I tell you they are fly. They are so fly. I can't wait. They said it should take about two weeks. So you already know I'm excited. Mm -mm -mm. I'm eating some hot soup. It tastes so good. My husband made it. Um, it has, it's a Jamaican style soup. It has potato, well, they call it yams. So it has yams, um, a dumpling, um, chicken, and I forget what this other pots. What's the name of the green thing? I forgot. I know what it is, but it's on the tip of my tongue. I can't remember the name. No, the green thing. No, okra. <laughs> yes, it has okra in it. Um, it also has like bananas, but I don't really eat that. I mean, I like it, but. It's not like I'm like, oh, let me just eat some bananas. You know what I'm saying? If I have a choice, so I don't really eat it. Mm -mm -mm. Today is rainy and cold outside too. So this soup is right on point. Anyway, when I was inside of the beauty supply store today, you know, I was carrying my Brandon... Blackwood bag. Here it is right here. I believe this is like one of his first bags or so. Um, I don't know the history of about the bag, so I don't want to speak on it because I don't want to say nothing wrong. But it is a gorgeous bag. But when I, I wasn't even paying any attention because I was so busy trying to find my stuff. And when I tell you, everybody that was in that store noticed this bag. It started with the girl at the cashier. And she's like, oh my gosh, that bag is so cute. Um, wow, it's it it's made so well. What is it? Or who's or whose bag is it? Or is it or is it just a bag? And I'm like, honey, no, it's not just a bag. It's by Brandon Blackwood. I said, you guys, um, really need to check him out. He makes also, if you think this is a beautiful bag, you need to look at his other stuff. But let me tell you, honestly, when you, um, with stuff that is made of good quality, people always notice, right? Like I'm not a name hog, um, for sure. I mean, there are definitely some brands that I love. I just can't afford them right now, but, um, I'm not a name hog, but honestly, when things are made well, you know, it's noticeable and not only is it noticeable, they're made, they're made so well, like you really can tell the difference. So that's why I'm on a mission <laughs> of trying to get some nice pieces in my collection, you know, because you, they last, you have them for a long time. You know what I'm saying? So 10 out of 10 for sure for nice pieces, you know? All right. So let me share with you guys, um, some stuff that I purchased from the beauty supply store while I was out. Okay. Um, now some of the, some of the stuff that I got is for my husband. As you guys know, those, those of you who watch me, you know that I do his hair and his beard and stuff. So I'm always buying products and stuff. Um, you know, for that. Okay. So this right here is the beard and hair oil. I purchased this. Now this is like his favorite, or this is the favorite that I picked for him. Okay. Um, this is the oil right here. It smells so good. Okay. Camera focus. Why is the camera? Maybe it's too close. Okay. So it's, I don't know why it's not focusing. All right. So yeah, this is the, um, the beard oil that I bought for, for him. There he goes. Um, yes, he loves it. Or shall I say I love it. It makes his beard smell um, very good. And it gives it a nice shine. All right. So I bought some of that because he's out of his um, products. 
Um, I also got some dye. I think it's pronounced begin or begin. Uh, not quite sure of the pronunciation, but I love this one for him as well. I dye his beard. Okay, so he likes his beard dyed. So this is what I use because this is the, um, it's no mixing. It's just combed in. And also, it it's a no stain. It is no stain. It actually is no stain. And this last, that, this dye right here also lasts um, on his beard longer than the other uh, dyes that I had tried. Okay, so I got two boxes of that. I, and that, that was the Jet Black. Um, if you guys, you know, you should, if your husband dyes his hair or his beard or whatever, you should try that brand out if you haven't because it's really good. And um, this is not a paid promotion. So this is my true thoughts. And I'm going to always give my true thoughts, honestly. Yep, I'm going to always give my true thoughts. Um, This right here is the Bouncy Curl Styling Foam. And I got this right here uh, for the wigs, for my wigs. Um, yeah, because I had ran out and just really hadn't gotten any for a while. So this is the styling foam for the wig, for my wigs. Um, this right here is also for my husband. This is a three-in-one. This is a three-in-one with the shampoo and the conditioner. Um, what is it? The leave-in? It is the, yeah, the shampoo. Oh, shampoo, conditioner, and moisturizer or moisturizing. So I got that. And that's the Wash's Beard. And I picked up because I needed a couple of things, um, some makeup. So I got this right here. This is the 3D Extreme Volume Mascara. So I uh, saw it and I got it. I've never used this brand before, but uh, what caught me is it, it said extreme. <laughs> so I don't, with lashes, I like to wear lashes, but I really don't wear them. And that's because I can't see to put them on. And then, you know, so they're just too big and, you know, behind my glasses. So it just doesn't work. It's a whole fiasco. So it doesn't work for me. So I love a bold mascara because, you know, my lashes are pretty long. And with a nice bold mascara, it's a look. So um, I got that. And then I just bought two black um, eye pencils, all right, and what is this, I thought this was the, uh, did I make a mistake, this is the lip pencil, it's a dark brown lip pencil, so, yeah, I got this, mm-hmm, yeah, so, I'm just now getting into, Lining my lips, you guys, because usually I never used to line my lips. I just used to just put on my lipstick. But when the other uh, the other day when I lined my lips, it looked so good, and I had the right pencil too. So it's like, oh, okay, um, I'm gonna start doing it because it is a look. Yes, I usually don't line my lips, but, um, you know, the other day I did it and I had a nice uh, brown pencil and it looked really good. So I'm like, okay, okay, I see what they be saying. And I'm like, it's a look. So for now on, I'm going to try and remember to line my lips. Yeah. So the day was pretty good, you guys. The day was pretty good. So now I'm just going to go and... Um, find some movies and watch some movies and edit um, my videos, you know. I'm going to try to do the Vlogmas, but we'll see how that goes. I'm going to try my endeavor best. I'm not saying that I am. I'm going to try, okay, because it's kind of hard, you know. I work and stuff. That's, that's kind of hard to do, but we'll guys, see. So this is what I wore out today. You guys saw this um, outfit, the one that I purchased from Pretty Little Thing. So, yeah, this um, is... 
I put on a nice black watch, the coach watch. And I just on, I just have on my silver hoops and then these um, silver necklaces. Yep, so this was it. This is what I wore. Oh yeah, and these boots right here. These, I've had these for, uh, for a while. You guys seen these, let me fix them. <laughs> you guys have seen these right here. These boots, these are like sock boots. They are so comfortable. They have like a little small heel, like maybe a one, one and a half inch heel. They're very comfortable. I can wear these all day long with no problems. Um, and it, it's really cute. It's so comfortable. It's like, like a sock boot. And I've had these for about maybe three years now and they still look I'm, um, absolutely fabulous. They still look good. And I get a lot of compliments on these boots as well. So yep, this is, this is what the look was today. Perfect. It's comfortable easy, easy breezy. So even though it was windy, raining, I was just in and out. And this is it from the back. Yep. Get it.